I am Anil Kumar. Welcome to my series on set theory. We will actually prove a very important identity for set theory which relates union and intersection. So what we have here is the intersection of the complements of two sets equals the complements of their union. Mathematically written as this is intersection of complements of A and B is equal to complement of union of A and B, right? That is what we need to prove. Now, let us first see and understand what this really means, right? Complement means something which does not belong to, right? So here, let me draw two sets A and B. Let's say this is set A for us. Okay, and uh, let us take a set B of this form. Let's say this is our set B. So these are the two sets. When we say complement of A, that means, let me first write down so that, you know, we don't get confused. So this is the sample space, right? This is the set A. And that is B. But when we say complement of A, then it means what? Complement of A means outside A, which is not contained in A, right? So this is the complement of A. It also includes this portion in B, right? So that is all the complement of A. Is that clear to you? Now, when we say complement of B, then it means what? Complement of B means outside B. That means everything kind of like this. Do you see this portion? Outside B. That means this also, right? So some portion could be inside A. Now, when we say intersection of these two complements, then it means everything which is outside this portion. Not in B, right? And not in A. Do you see this portion? Not in B and not in A. So everything outside is what is called intersection of complements of these sets. So I hope that is absolutely clear. Now I'm actually I'm making it darker so that you can see the other half. I mean the other part of the equation. Now what is A union B? A union B is everything which is very light in shade. And when we say complement, it is that outside part which I have made very dark. Do you understand? And as you can see, both are equal. Both are equal, correct? I could have made four different images to show you this, but I hope this much is enough, right? Now let's try to prove this mathematically. Now when we are trying to say that the complement's intersection is equal to the complement of union, in that case, they are absolutely equal. They are absolutely equal only if, uh, let me show it the other way. Let us take up something in this portion, which is complements of the two sets A and B, right? So let us say the element X, X is equal to a set, which is basically complement intersection intersection of these complements and let y be equal to the right half which is union of a and b and its complement right so we read it the other way we say complement of a union b so let that be y now when i'm trying to say that they are both equal say in set theory always whenever you want to prove that two sets are equal then they are only equal if they are subset of one another right so that means 
that we need to prove that y is a subset of x and x is a subset of y. Only then the two sets are equal, right? So I hope you get this concept. So let us now prove that one is subset of the other, right? So let's begin by on the left side we have uh, let's say y belongs to this particular set which is complement of union of a and b so let us take an element y which belongs to the set y which is i'm going to say as equal to this part complement of a union b so now we are talking about the right hand side we have taken an element e at the element y which belongs to the complement of a union b correct so when i say that y belongs to the complement of a and b that means that y does not belong to a union b right if y is outside this world, then y cannot be inside that world. That's what I'm trying to say, correct? So, y does not belong to A union B. And therefore, y does not belong to A and y does not belong to B. Perfect. So, if it does not belong to A, it should belong to its complement. So that means y belongs to a complement and y belongs to the complement of b now since y belongs to the complement of a and y also belongs to complement of b that means y belongs to the intersection of these two complements right it belongs to both of them correct so that really means that every element y that actually belongs to the set y also belongs to that is our set x right so that also belongs to x is that clear so we have shown one thing right here that y is subset of x is that clear so that is one half of this proof we have to also prove that the left side is subset of right side you get an idea right so so we'll again start in a similar fashion this time we'll pick up an element x which belongs to this x right that is to say where x is equal to the intersection of these complements right so that really means that since it belongs to the intersection of these that x belongs to both of them right so so x belongs to the inter uh, complement of a and x belongs to complement of b that means if it belongs to the complement then x does not belong to a and x does not belong to b that means that x does not belong to a union b correct and if it does not belong to a union b it belongs to what it belongs to its complement which is a union b complement this is actually the set y so every element of the set x belongs to the set y. So that means that x is subset of y. Clear? So since we have shown that y is subset of x and x is subset of y, that means x 
is equal to y and x is what x is the intersection of complements of a and b right so that means a and b their complements intersection is equal to complement of a union b is that clear to you so that is how actually you could prove that the intersection of the complements of two sets equals the complements of their union perfect so so that is where the line breaks right? the intersection of complements of two sets intersection of complements of two sets is equal to the complement of their union perfect so that is how you could actually prove it i hope that makes sense feel free to write your comments and share your views and if you like and subscribe to my videos that'd be great thanks for watching and all the best